YouTube. So today I'm going to be doing my third installment of my nail polish collection. Um, today I'm going to be doing China Glaze. And yes, I did spend a lot of time doing these little crazy designs. So that shows you how much free time I have. Um, but I'm just going to put this out there like I'm pretty sure you've heard everybody say. I'm not doing this to brag or anything. Or yeah, anything like that. I'm just doing this to show you my nail polish collection. Um... So, I'm not going in any particular order or whatever, because after doing this, yeah, after doing these design thingies, they I wasn't going to spend time putting them back in order. So, I'm just going to be pulling them at random. Um, so, yes, let's get started. This is Galactic Grey, and this was actually my one and only um, China Glaze polish in their holographic form. I know how awkward that sounds, but you know what I mean. Um, that's Shore Bright, which is a beautiful milky pastel purple. Um, it's really pretty. It's like perfect for springtime. Okay, are you jelly? And a fun fact about this polish, when I bought this, you know, I, you would have thought by the name, are you jelly? I would have assumed it was a jelly polish. But no, like, I thought it was an opaque polish when I bought it because it was, like, filled to the brim, right? And then when I brought it home, I was like, what? <laughs> like, I was kind of disappointed, but yeah, whatever. Um, so this is Flying Dragon. And this was kind of a disappointment polish, but yeah. Fuchsia Fanatic. And this was actually my... Um, very first China Glaze nail polish. Um, I was kind of, I was kind of obsessed with pinks when I first bought it. So, yeah, I do still wear it, um, but morally in the summertime. It's not as bright as it looks on camera, but it's a really pretty pink. Icicle, which is your typical silver polish. Ruby Pumps, which is super famous here on YouTube, or in the beauty world, I should say. Sorry about my camera going out of focus again. I have to say that at least once in every video. <laughs> Fairy Dust, which is my absolute favorite glitter... Well, not glitter, well... Actually, well, it's my favorite glitter top coat of all time. Like, it's subtle, but it's so pretty. How will you do in? And it's like a dark purple polish with purple and orange glitter. Swing Baby, which is like a rose gold polish. Purple Panic. And it's a bright pink polish. So I don't know why it's called Purple Panic, but yeah. <laughs> Tongue and Chic. Beautiful teal polish. Like a tealish, a dark teal, but yeah. Ready and Willing. Which is another frosty polish. It's more red than you're seeing it on camera here. Rendezvous with you. Which is a shimmery metallic. Like, I don't know how to explain this. It's like a shimmery metallic polish. Hey Sailor, which is a fire red nail polish. Don't make me wine. Which is like a purple, purpley burgundy polish. Again, it's a frost. Blue Year's Eve, which is a dark blue shimmery polish. Yellow Polka Dot Bikini, and this is actually one of my only yellow polishes. Um, it's super bright, perfect for summertime. Keeping It Teal. Again, this is a jelly nail polish, but I actually knew it was a jelly, unlike the other one. This is Four Leaf Clover, which is a green polish. And I know this 
looks a lot like keeping it teal so I'm just gonna show you a um show you the two polishes side by side so this is keeping it teal and the one on my left is for the clover and I know it doesn't look like a big difference but keeping it teal is definitely more of a blue of a brighter blue whereas four leaf clover is definitely more of a green polish and it's more opaque obviously um so yeah that is my nail polish collection not my nail polish collection my china glaze nail polish collection for you guys um please leave me a comment telling me what you think of this video and don't forget to subscribe and like this video and yeah i will talk to you guys in my next video take care and yeah bye